everyone and welcome back to another vlog. This is going to be a different type of vlog which is why I've got a different background. I've added my sunflowers just because they're beautiful. So today I'm here to tell you that I've just recently become a Fab Stuff ambassador. So what is the Academy of Fabulous Stuff? I'm going to tell you all about it. I'm going to get you really excited and hopefully you're going to get involved with it. So the Academy of Fab Stuff works around three things. Number one, search. So whether it's you yourself and you've put something into place and you think this is a really good idea, other people should know this. Whether you've seen something that's happened in practice and you think, do you know what, that's really, really good. Because this is all about sharing positive experiences, positive changes that's going on that can really benefit our healthcare system. Because the world needs a lot more positivity, a lot more sharing. And wouldn't that just be amazing if we could all work well together and share our amazing experiences? So no matter where in the world you're working, this is worldwide, not just the UK, not just our NHS, not our healthcare system, this is everywhere. So if you're watching this, whichever band or grade you are, whatever role you're working in, and let's just say someone or yourself has implemented something really good into practice and you think, do you know what? This works really, really well. I'm going to share this. And that's when you share. So now we've come to sharing all of this information. So firstly, the Fab Stuff Academy has created this hashtag. This is my hashtag, by the way. It's not a cardboard box. You know, little box, big box, cardboard. I don't know. I can't even remember that. <laughs> anyway, back to what we were talking about. They created this hashtag, um, which is FabChange70. Go and have a look at it and see what amazing things people have done. So basically for the Fab Change 70, this is part of the NHS 70th birthday, which is this year, as you all know. And if you don't know, why don't you know? Go and have a look. <laughs> so this is part of the Fab Change 70. There's a hashtag being created to share all the amazing ideas. And as part of that, on the website, there's a whole submission page. So if you go onto there, so firstly you've gone and you've searched for all the amazing things that's going on in your work, in your workplace. Now you're coming to the time where you want to share and shout about your achievements. Not only do you want to shout and actually be proud of what you've done or what somebody else has done in your area, but this is an opportunity for if someone else to think, do you know what, that works really well in their area. I wonder if it'd work well in my area. Wouldn't that be amazing? And then they might come to you for advice and to talk to you about what's going on and how they can implement it into their practice. And it's just going to have this amazing knock-on effect where everyone's sharing these ideas and making great changes around the workplace. And just even the smallest of things can really make a huge difference. And just a couple of things that have already been shared with the Fab Academy. There's a, an amazing guy called Ignar. I always say your name wrong. I, th I feel like I say your name wrong. I'm really sorry if you're watching this and I've got your name wrong. Please tell me how to say it properly. So he went out and he's created this whole playlist of LGBT music for people with dementia because this is just an amazing way to bring back such powerful and wonderful memories for them and it really helps stimulate and give them a better quality of life. I'm going to put the links below to all of these pages so please go and have a look and check these people out. Also the next girl I want to mention is Rachel and she is just incredible. She's gone through such a rough rough time and she's got a couple of stoma bags, urostomy and illostomy bag. She's got both of those and she's just amazing. Her blogs are fantastic. I'm going to post the links below. And Rachel wants to raise more awareness around the urostomy bag. And to be honest, I myself, um, I don't know much about these types of stoma bags. Uh, you only really hear about the illostomy bags. Um, if you don't know what they are, I'm going to put some links below just to give you some guidance as well. But mainly look at Rachel's blog because she explains it really well and it's fantastic to hear from a real person and that real experience, if that makes sense. So she just wanted to raise the awareness of it and help other people and support other people as well that might be going through the same things that she has. And she's just fantastic. Just please go and look at the pages and see what you think. Another thing that was set up is Fab Feedback Fridays, which is amazing. Again, the links are below. I'm not going to go into too much details about everything because um, it's just going to be a really long, boring video for you all and I really don't want that. So they are just a few of the things that are on the Fab Academy page. Please go down and have a look at the links below because it's really amazing to read all of the amazing stories that people are doing. And lastly but not least, number three, celebrate it. 
So celebrate. So the Academy of Fab Stuff want to celebrate all of these amazing achievements going on around their healthcare profession. And at the end of the year in November, there's going to be a big award ceremony and it's going to be amazing. It's going to be fantastic. And what a way to end the year. And I just wanted to leave you on one last little tiny note. Always remember that the smallest of things that you do, the slightest smile, the thank you, the kind gestures that you do, random acts of kindness every single day can really mean something to somebody else. You don't know, walking down that street, what that person's been going through walking past you. Give them a smile. Don't have your head down in your phones. Don't have your earphones in. Just give them a smile because sometimes that's all it takes to make somebody's day. And that could be a making or breaking point for somebody because the smallest of things can often make the biggest impact on somebody and sometimes we forget that and sometimes we just need to take a step back and think, do you know what, I'm gonna do something good today for someone. Even just holding open a door, I'm gonna do that for somebody. And wouldn't it be amazing if we all did that? If we just had this massive ripple effect of everybody doing just one good deed a day, wouldn't the world be an amazing place? I think so. So that is it from me. We are at the end of the vlog and I just want to say a massive thank you to everyone that's tuned in and watched this. Don't forget to subscribe. I hope everyone has an amazing week and stay fabulous.